Yo, yo, welcome back. Today's video is different as well because uh, we'll be using my truck stereo to show you what RDS is. RDS is Radio Data System. Now on the Portaback H4M, we have the ability to transmit RDS. Um, so on your vehicles, on your uh, console, your display for your radio, you tune into whatever it is, right? Like country news or foreign affairs or whatever. You have your frequency. So say like we're like at 97.3. That's your main frequency of what that radio service is coming in at. Now, RDS is a subcarrier frequency kind of underneath that that carries the data of what that channel or frequency is. Now, if I decide to go to something over here, right, and I want to lower the volume so I don't get flagged by YouTube for playing something that they deem copyright restricted. Now, you can see up here that we got the uh, KMT TX. That's an RDS. Uh, if we go to this one right here, we have Dave FM. So those are what RDS is. That is that kind of that sub carrier frequency here that it just populated the day's plays living in America by James Brown. Diving into this, we're going to select a frequency. Uh, I want to tune my port pack uh, into 98.3 because I know that's the open frequency in my area. And then I'm going to kind of run through the settings real quick on the port pack and then as well as your settings for your stereo. Uh, let's go back out of here and we're going to go dive into transmit. So turning our unit on, we're going to go to transmit here. And then I'm going to scroll down here to RDS. A few weeks ago, we just, we went over Poxy TX. Now we are on RDS. Now under RDS, we have a few different things to look at. So program type, that's going to be news, affairs, info, sport, educate, drama, yada, yada, yada. So I'm just going to leave mine on info for now. Uh, program IDs. I will put a link in the description below for the Portapack Mayhem uh, documents that goes over all these other settings because there's kind of a lot in this one, so I'm not going to go over all of them. Now, I am running firmware 2.2.0, I believe. Let's see here. I forgot. Whichever one they just released a few weeks ago. Yeah, 2.2.0. And I did realize something when it comes to RDS that when I go to set my program service name so say it's at test one two three four by default if i want to change that to say J O J O A T right and i hit okay and then i'm going to traffic announcement you can you can turn these on and off if you want to and then if i go to my text box up here and i go to set this text and the default is radio text test A, B, C, D, 1, 2, 3, 4. Now, if I change all this, or like and subscribe if you find this stuff fun and useful. Now, when I go back up here, uh, you can do your program type up here as well. So let's go keep that one at info. Transmit radio text. Yes, I want to. And then my name. And then my frequency is already set to the 98.3. And I'm going to go ahead and go up here now to my stereo. And I'm going to change my frequency to 98.3. I noticed something that on 2.2.0 firmware, when I hit start, usually it fails out and there's an error happening on the, on the back end here. So I'll show you. So that's what I get. I'll just put a little note in the GitHub for the port pack mayhem. And then you can see your DFU dump back to RDS. So back to transmit RDS. And I'm not going to set anything on this one this time. But I did find out that as of 2.2.0, like, like I keep saying, because I just want to make that very, very clear. And this may have already been fixed in, in the nightly. I'm not sure. But if I delete all this and I go to like and, and then I go back over here. Let's go. I can turn that to info. And I'm going to leave this one this time on the first main page uh, as default. I got info down there. I'm at 98.3 and I go start. I don't get any kind of errors this time. And then you can see up here that we are now receiving that RDS as a test 1, 2, 3, 4. And then after a while, it should populate the like that I put in there over here somewhere. All right, there we go. So I had to reset my port pack a few times. And now you can see here that we've got like and sub. And then we got the station of test 
and I'm on I moved to 98.5 and you can see over here that we are on 98.5 and then my text right there is like and sub that is kind of really it for RDS really not a lot to it it's just radio data service of uh, just a subcarrier frequency underneath the main frequency that says hey this is my info to display on the screen so I guess in a sense you can kind of consider it like a dial tone almost you know for the phone number that you're going to call it's just that dial tone so uh pretty simple if you guys have any questions reach out to me in the comments below or join my github or no or join my discord uh if you are looking for a portapec h4m i will put a link in the description below as well for open source scr labs and a coupon to save a small percentage on one so not a lot but hey everything is something in these crazy times i appreciate your time guys uh, like i said thanks again for everything uh like subscribe to the fun stuff and i will see you guys in the next video